Matt, are you impressed with the party? This is unbelievable. I'm pretty I'm stoked about this party. Here we have found the only <laughs> dissenting voice in the whole crowd, and she paid 25 bucks to say it. <laughs> Do you love CJSW? I love CJSW with all my heart, which is why I've been volunteering for the last five years. Hi, my name is Walter. I do a show here, I've done a show here for 30 years. It's a good time. And who are you? My name is Nasty Bob, and I don't do a show anymore, but I did for a long time, a long time ago. So I can show. See, he's old. Actually, you know, this is part of it. Bob is a lawyer now and he's got no memory. <laughs> yeah. Good luck, people. <laughs> Probably about 40 members of CJSW, and we used to dream of having 40 people listen to us uh, back then. <laughs> Jane, what's your best CJSW moment ever? I was thinking about the phone conversation I had with Chad uh, when he phoned to offer me a position. And uh, that is, that's pretty amazing. I don't know, because it just, it started seven years of an era that just defined me. What's your best CJSW moment? Uh, when I first started at CJSW, I was hosting film clips Monday nights from 9 till 10. There was a young woman named Jane McCullough who was co-hosting the art show from 8 till 9. And uh, my co-host left the show. And so I thought I should ask her to co-host the show with me so when I ask her to go to the movies, it won't seem so awkward. And uh, we started dating three months later. We got married seven months later. And now we have seven years later. Seven years later. We have a child together now. So pretty much the best moment at CJSW was when I met my wife. It depends. It's all uh, dropped in a handheld camera. So if, you, if you want a, uh, a, a full kit with pants, you can do that. If you want. Who are these crazy people you're talking to? 
all of them are here for CJSW's 25th anniversary party. Are you aware there's a monkey boy back there? I see a monkey boy! Oh, that's awesome! <laughs> By the way, holy s***, Caitlin! This is wrong in so many ways, it's awesome. <laughs> There's people downstairs in the line that aren't coming in. How come? <laughs> uh, well, I guess it's, uh, we're already at capacity would be the only reason I know that. Uh, hopefully they'll get in eventually and we'll catch something that they want to see. Is this a good representation of all of our fans, our listeners in Calgary? Um, I think it's definitely a pretty good representation, at least of the people who have been involved in this local uh, music community for the last little while. Okay, we take it so we have a lot of programming that goes beyond music, I suppose, but, but tonight it's definitely seems like a, a time for everyone to have fun and just enjoy what we've done for the local music scene here in town. I'm Cameron Stang. Cameron, do you love this party? Yes, I do. Uh, I'm 42. I know people at CDSW since the first day they went on FM. I know a bunch of these bands, and I've just been waiting for this night all like they're like, it's, like it's the best high school reunion ever. Can you hear the love in the DJ's voice? Oh, God, yes. Yes, I can. Uh, I'm Shane Brinker. I uh, was on the board in, uh, I believe, 2004 and did the show uh, Beyond Beats and Feathers. That's one of the spoken word programs, SCGW, that focuses on what issues? Uh, Aboriginal uh, issues, arts, and entertainment. prove to Calgary, to our, to the fans, to anyone who hasn't heard of CHSW, what does it prove? That there's reciprocation. What's it proof of? Well, it's, it's proof that the uh, tiara is not made of plastic. Ah. And there, you, you melt that sucker down and there's 30 bucks worth of precious metals. And uh, I, don't, I don't know what it proves, but I, I think it proves that probably Calgary has always been the most underrated music scene in the country. Taking credit for this? No, the people who asked me the question fit all the work. So, uh, there's a great committee. Uh, uh, the staff, Katie in particular, did an outstanding job. That's that's who did the work. And then the bands, and all the people, the, the, these freaks and weirdos walking behind me. This is an amazing setup. Can you take credit for it? <laughs> I actually shouldn't really take much credit at all. I, I have been at arm's length, sort of, from the organization of this party. Um, but definitely kudos because Katie DuHamel, our office coordinator, has got all the volunteers together uh, and our organizing committee, which has a, a host of, of prominent show promoters and such around town who have been very great supporters of the station all along. Um, and yeah, they've, they've been instrumental in making this all happen for sure. Now, was this a party or what? This is an amazing party. This is. I hey, look what I did! <laughs> a 
lot of planning to do dinner. We did a, and a lot of help. Like, like if we didn't have experts and people that knew what they were doing at CJSW to support and like do it all, we'd be totally screwed. <laughs> Chad, you can throw in the towel. Are you done for? Do you surrender? What, over tonight? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you can quit while you're ahead. Are you kidding me? 